Hi guys, <clears throat> welcome back, episode 26. Um, we're, we're very, very inconsistent at the moment. Yeah. Some really inconsistent results. Uh, and we sit fifth. Um, 14 points off of Chelsea, so that's a worry. We're looking okay in our Champions League group. It's a really, really tough group for the second phase. Um, and not great that everyone's essentially won one game. So, you know... Anyway, we've uh, we've got a bit of a break from Europe now until uh, double Madrid in February, um, and if we get past Forest, we'll have a FA Cup game squeezed in the middle there. So we'll see how that goes. Anyway, we've got West Brom today. Um, Alexander Funrod is looking a little bit tired. Let's get him off for Gravison. Um, let's get out there. Uh, West Brom sit. 13th, so they usually do quite well after a couple of seasons on this, but um, we definitely need a win here because we are we're, we're also um, slipping away from fourth place. Newcastle is seven points behind them, and um, on Champions League football is a must. You know, we're like we've got it once now, and we can't not miss out on it um, for a second season for a um. Sorry, we can't miss out on it. Ugh. Jason Roberts. Bloody hell. Mm. Come on. Look at Varenko with an injury. And Bakaloglu's not playing great. Um, let's go for a shift here and we'll bring Rooney and Arta always does quite well. Triple substitution there, try and get something back in this game. We're having the shots on target. We're just bloody goalkeepers are just coming out of like nowhere and having worldies against us, which is really, really costing us. And there's West Brom going 2 0 up. Shiotis. <sighs> Well, that was a really, really poor start. Like, we're having the shots on target. Look, 14 shots on freaking goal. <sighs> we're now, now down to six. We are eight points off of Arsenal. Like, it is not good going. Really, really not. We're on massive, massive str struggle straight. We've really, really, really got to turn this form around. Is the squad too big? Is it this tactic, finally? It should be okay. Like, it's realistically the same kind of tactic that does well on here. That four, four at the back, one DMC, two, um, two, you know, four at the back. One here, here, here. The only thing is I've just popped your wing backs to push up. But uh, we've done well with it so far, but we're just, we're, we're really in a bad patch of form. Shout in the 17th. We've got to get a wing back over them here. Um, a wing back over them. We've got to get a win over them here. Otherwise, you know, I mean... Yeah, like, I'm, just, I'm lost for words. Like I say, Champions League football is a minimum. Like, we might be lucky to bloody get in, in Europa League at this rate. Um, I have not been impressed with Shiotis at all. It's terrible, terrible goalkeeping from him. I'm going to drop him for Jamie Langford. Um, it hasn't impressed either. You know what? It's January. It's January. What am I doing? I've got 16 million. Can we afford him? Can we afford him? I'm wasting my time. Just, let's just look for him. Palmer. Sebastian Freire. Let's test their resolve. 
10 million. Straight off the bat, 10 million. See how that goes. Um, there's always Costanza at River. He'd be another option, but I think um, I think Sebastian Frey is the man to go for. Well, Tess Palmer's resolved now. Oh, and look at this. We've got Raphael van der Vaart coming in on a free transfer next year. Excellent. Excellent news there. Um, we're going to have quite a big squad, but I'll, I'll be moving on some of these. Probably Justin Walker will go. Um, Gravison's not having a good year. There'll, there'll, there'll be players that we're shifting, shifting there. Barsom um, could be one of, if I can get someone really good to play behind those strikers. Um, Daniel Bonera as well, really good. Another defender, he's coming on a free. We we just get so you know ooh, someone's interested. Liverpool and Sunji Hay. Um, so it could spend the end. I mean, Stephen Caldwell has only just arrived for super cheap. Um, but, you know, if I got a decent bid for Distan, um, he could potentially go to make way. Um, but, yeah, like, I mean, you know, if we really, really want to push for the title again, we need... Yeah, see, they've... All right. What about after a whole heap of internationals, which you'll never play? I mean, he would do, but we, we would probably not get that far. Look at this. We have... My God, it's disgustingly far away. And look at this. Look at this. Aston Villa on 36 points as well. We could, with even some more porn, be tumbling down to ninth. I'm pretty sure the board demanded European qualification. So, that's something to... Mm, something to consider. Right, Charlton... We've got to we've got to turn things around. Who was crap last game? Kennedy, Bakalakloglu, and Shiotis have been dropped. So Kennedy out for Farnord. Um, yeah, let's swap Farnord with Gravison just for that center. Mark Kerr's back actually. Let's get Mark Kerr back in the starting lineup. Um, Big Ibra. Ibra wasn't great, but we'll leave him on there. Get rid of Rooney. He's not really playing that well. All right, kick off Charlton. They are bottom, close to 16th. <sighs> I've lost. I like to play Olaf Melberg. That's a top signing. He is. I mean, he's not playing great, but he is a really good signing. Um, we're on fast. That'll do. Don't want to go too fast. Come on, guys. I haven't had a shot on target yet. Yeah, um, <coughs> Palmer came back with that 20 mil and said no go. So I think um, in the summer, Sebastian Frey will be our top, top priority. Yes, Mark. Uh, let's send to Bestfield as well in goal. Melbourne Carlson in injured. Hopefully we can... Um, bag another one just to put the game beyond Charlton at this point. Yes, Farner Road. Alright, good stuff. Langford's on an 8, which is excellent. Mark Kerr's got a thigh injury. Let's get him off. Oh, he's in a Farner Road. He just tires easily. Don't know why. Um... This, this puts us back up into fifth. Game in hand. Okay. 
you know, still five points so behind Arsenal. Game in hand. Anyway, it looks to be a relatively comfortable win. Arta, who I was really worried about. I thought he might not even play any games, but he's turned into a bit of a super sub. I've been really impressed with him. Good. The border, please. Right, we've got Nottingham Forest in the FA Cup. And then Fulham. New Assel, Tottenham, Liverpool. <clears throat> All right, we've got Forest in the FA Cup. I'm going to play play a relatively strong team for this because um, because yeah, <laughs> basically um, the um, pro is suspended. Gravison's also suspended. All right, that's good. We've got Jamie Victory. And we'll go for Walker there. Yeah, I want to play a strong team because this could be our only kind of chance of um, silverware. Um, so Liverpool have come in for Sunji High for five million. Now um, there's a little bit of a trick where if you add a fee after an international cap of a, a large amount and the club has that money, um, they'll pay it. So I've never actually done this before, and I've seen it pop up on the forum people talking about. It, so I thought, you know what? Let's give it a try. Um, so Liverpool have accepted this. They're offering a contract to him. So Sunji Hai as well is obviously Chinese as we know. And he does play for China. He's in the squad there. He's obviously one of their, their best players. Um, they don't have any fixtures coming up for the rest of this year. I'm sure they'll get one soon. Um, some soon. So eventually when he gets that, um, we'll get 20 million. So that was the plan there. And because I'm getting, um, what's his name? Italian guy in. We should be good there for central defenders because we also have Distan, who's not playing much, and um, old Taribo West as well. So we, 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 and Caldwell, we look really good for central defenders, so it's not a big issue. So uh, I know he's a good player, but I thought I'd, I'd just try and um, use that little thing there. I'm not going to do it all the time. I've just never used it, and I thought, you know, Liverpool are a big club. They've probably got some cash. Let's give it a whirl. See how it goes. I mean, we we might actually actually bankrupt them. But anyway, all good. Uh, except we can't beat Forest here. I mean, they are a Premier League team, but not a very good one at that. They are having a lot of shots on target, as are we. And obviously their goalkeeper... Matteo Sereni, who who's who's a good go goalkeeper in this game. He's fairly average, actually. His pace is bad. We should be scoring past him, but we can't seem to, which is great. Um, And this is where they nick one. I don't really want to do a bloody... I don't really want to have to do a replay. This is just so irritating. Come on. Oh, it's going to be a replay. We're not... Oh, Okoronko! Yes! Yes, Okoronko. We should probably, like, close down the game here, actually, just in case... Oh, good, good win. We had enough bloody shots on target. Uh, Mike Duff with the assist. Excellent, good. Okay, whatever, he's banned for one game. All good. Um, right, Fulham. Excuse me, Newcastle. Fulham aren't doing too good. They're 19th. Newcastle are fourth. They're a good team. Tottenham, bottom. And we've got Liverpool as well, who are fifth, so... I uh, don't know if we'll squeeze all four of those games in before the end of the episode. We'll try. Um, and then we'll come back for our um, the return of the Champions League. Um, I was just thinking, Liverpool are going to need a work permit for Sinji High, aren't they? That's why it's taking so long to go through. Just wondering if it's going to go through before the window closes. 
Yep, there you go. Ooh. ooh, ooh. Okay, so we've sold Sunji High. Hopefully, trying to have a game soon. Straw teams, Bristol City. That's a decent. That's a good one. We can, we can rest to that. So Sunji High is gone. We make five million at the moment, which is good. A um, bit more in the kitty. We've got twenty million in the bank now. We've got some good players coming in on freeze. Um, we'll look to shift, move some on, and we could. We'll, we'll hopefully TV money and 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 whatnot will we'll get a, almost 50 mil I reckon and the bulk of that we will spunk on Sebastian Frey I think that's the plan anyway alright guys back for the full game um, just realized as well we got some news after I've just sold Sanji High I forgot about the bloody African Cup of Nations so we're going to lose Toribo West, Okoronko, Yobo and Ibrahim Said and um, Rayed as well. So I'm losing four defenders. So I'm so glad that I sold Sanji High. Um, <laughs> great stuff. And I dropped Ibrahimovic. He hasn't really played that well. I mean, he's played well, but he's not scoring. Um, anyway, let's go to the game kick off I believe Fulham are down the bottom they are we should win this Jamie victory get in still six six points behind Arsenal though still six points behind Newcastle and we play them so I will be hoping for a victory against Newcastle. Well, you can't get a victory against Newcastle. We're in trouble. Um, we're dominating Fulham as we should be. And Nelka's playing well, but he's not getting the goals. I thought my striking, my strike force would be awesome this season with like 30 goal and Nelka the last two seasons in a row. Duff, yes. And then Ibrahimovic. But just can't get just can't get goals on the board. I mean Anelka's is in one shot. He's playing a nine though, like he's playing well, but he's out to an eight. Yes, Mark Kerr. This is about to um, close the game down then, but there's no point. That's a great victory. That's what we needed. Saeed's banned for a game. Brilliant. Um, right, we've got Newcastle left on the first. Newcastle next on the first. That'll be a big one. And then Spurs, Liverpool. Got to win all three of them, especially. I mean, especially the Newcastle, Liverpool game. I mean, Tottenham are bottom of the table, so we sh that's an especially win as well. Um get some good form heading into the champions <coughs> excuse me um, one of their fixtures starts February that's disappointing so we're gonna miss them for like all of Feb pretty much two really important Champions League games <coughs> excuse me anyway let's push on to the Newcastle game Right, guys, back for the Newcastle game. Uh, I've lost all my African stars. Okoronko said, Joseph Yobo, um, Taribo West. So um, I've switched around. So Caldwell is going to move up. Uh, we've got Risp on the bench now. Um, Harlan is going to occupy that DMC role with Jeff Whitley uh, on the bench. And uh, Leon Poe is still injured. So let's get out there. Let's get this done. This is it needs to be a massive win because they are three points ahead of us. That's a good goal. Ibrahimovic, finally. It's been a while since he scored, which is, you know, not great. Farnered, yes. We've hit a bit of purple patch after losing to Zlatan again. 
after losing to West Brom. They got Figo. Bloody hell. He moves around so much on this game, it's ridiculous. Nicky, oh. Playing well. Everyone looks okay. Get back out there. And Ghazi. They got bloody Filippo and Ghazi as well. God, no wonder they're doing well this season. Still got Kieran Dyer as well. Titus Bramble. It's a good player on this. Ibrahimovic with his hat trick. I think the change as well has been Langfield in goal. He's he's been playing really really well lately. Um, let's get Farner it off. And Kerr. And Ibra's got his hat trick. So good. It's looking a really good win over a really really solid um, Newcastle team. So I'm really really happy with this. Pushes us up into fifth, and we're only three points behind Newcastle now, and five behind Arsenal. The title is gone, I feel. We're way too far behind to, to catch that back. Zlatan, man of the match. Could see him getting some goals. Good stuff. Where are we looking? Spurs on Wednesday, and Liverpool on Saturday. <coughs> Bag three in a row. Hopefully we can improve on that. Make it five in a row, heading into the... Champions League game against Madrid. We'll probably rest a lot for that Bristol City game, I'd say. Although we are missing a few players because of African Cup of Nations, but oh well. Good job selling Sunji High. <coughs> Righto. Tottenham. They're bottom of the table. Um, got a few tight players out there, as in Nicky Ferenko. Get him off a back of Um I had Caldwell go last game. A five. He got a five. Yeah, you're off for risp. Cool. No. These three games, I did say the Newcastle and Liverpool were absolute must-wins, but this is a must-win as well. We're, we're, we're far behind. We need to, you know, pick up on these games. And oh, I've said it many times before, there are no easy games in the Premier League. I mean, Tottenham, Tottenham bottom of the table. They have such a good team. Jetsy Dudek, Simon Davis, Leather King, Tim Cahill, Robbie Keane, Jesus. Tottenham are going to score here. Oh God! Right, it's pretty even. There you go. There it is. Far out. Just Lauren on there. <sighs> Farner, it's too late though. I don't think. It'll, there you, see, there you go. The bottom of the freaking table. <sighs> Inconsistency is killing us. Right, Liverpool to finish off. 
Right, Liverpool. Leon Pro is back. Get fear. No, we'll keep right Phillips on the bench actually, because I've got Distan that can play left back. Um, any other changes to the crap game at Tottenham? Just a lot of sixes. Barca and Ibra. Maybe it's too many chopping and changing. I don't know. Fana, it's not good. Alright. This is... It's a huge game here. Got to get something out of this. Because then we can leapfrog them. We have played two extra games in the... God, we're in trouble. <sighs> Making more chances. Come on. Playing so much better than them. Alright, we're not winning tackles. They're creaming us in that department. Anelka, yes! He played a little... No, he didn't. No, I'm thinking of someone else. Alright, let's get back out there. Uh, everyone looks okay. <clears throat> Anelka. Condition. Everyone looks okay. Gravison and Bakaloglu aren't playing well. Put Justin Walker on for Gravison. Um, Kerr's on a yellow. Let's get him off as well. One more would be good. Sunji, hi. Hi. How's he playing? It's on a nine, obviously. Watch him pop up and grab a freaking goal. <sighs> Far out. Right. really annoyed. I mean the title's gone. The title the title is gone, 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 skis. Um shocking defence. Just just inconsistent. I mean lose to West Brom, beat Charlton, beat Fulham, beat Newcastle, then lose to bottom place Tottenham, draw against Liverpool. Okay, yeah, but like we should have won that game, and we should have won that game. Six points, 52. We should be fourth. Simple as that, but we're not. Anyway, guys, I um, hope you're enjoying this. I am, despite the fact it's frustrating. Please leave a like, comments, always appreciate.